Hey guys, Erica, and I'm going to show you how you can see in the title how to make a 1.5 um, Minecraft book server. Now, the reason I say I'm tired and shit like that is because I am. It's like 8 pm, up and up all night. <coughs> so, what you're going to do is you're going to go to the description, the media fire link. It is the link to the 1.5 um, server.jar. So, when you download that, you're going to put it in a folder, which is going to be your server folder. Um, so you can see I have it here. And now this, how to make this, you need to make a batch file. <laughs> Basically you open a new notepad. <coughs> and then you're going to copy and paste this code right here. That's only this in the description as well. Um, yeah, so you just paste it in. Go into file and save. Um, find where your uh, server thing is. And then call it something like server star or run server. Save as all files and make sure you put the extension dot bat at the end of it. And there you go. So now when you run this, it will come up this, all this shit. Most of this stuff doesn't really matter, it's just shit errors. And then it will generate your folder. <coughs> I'm also going to try to get plugins and stuff like that. <coughs> so, <coughs> if. <coughs> oh, fuck's sake. <coughs> you can put your single player <coughs> on pause just because I'm going to just cough to death. Okay, sorry about that. What I was saying is you can put your single player maps into your server so your friends can play. I do that, you just go on to run and to present up there percent. Basically, go into your Minecraft folder in update it and grab your world and throw it in. Um, you're gonna have to rename it to World though, or whatever. Um, so once you've done that, you can go back into your server thing and close this here. And you see, <coughs> you have got all the stuff: the band players, band IPs, um, ops, which is basically like mods, operators. <coughs> so and then we have oh server. Um, make sure it's the property file, not the text document server. In here, you can set the name of the world so. Yeah, um, you can make <coughs> you can make your world a hell world. Um, you can spawn monsters on and off, make, which means like no monsters or yes monsters. Online mode, which is obviously going to be true. Spawn animals, which is as you, if you don't know, it's um, pigs and cows and stuff like that. Server IP, leave this blank. Um, just like, don't put your actual the, the IP server in there. Just leave it like that. Um, PvP level seed server port that has to be like that as well. Well, it doesn't really, but people don't even actually have to add in the port. I don't think, unless you do. I'm not 100% sure. I think you have to port forward. I'm not 100% sure. Allow flight, which is basically for fly mod. You can turn it on and off. Um, wireless and spawn protection. So, there we go. So for plugins, you're going to go to <coughs> bucket.org. Once you're here, you click on forms. You don't have to sign up or anything, just go straight to forms. Go down to temporary plugin list, or you can go to plugin releases. I'm just going to go into plugin list as it's quite easier. Unless you want to look at brand new plugins, you go to here. But. So, as you can see, you have admin tools, anti griefing tools, chat related, all, yeah, you can see it. Um, basically, what I'm going to be looking for is something basic like. Um, so there's a um, plugin called PLG Essentials, which is basically. Time, give, TP here, um, and etc. So, here's the time here. Here's the commands actually. So, as you can see, you can change the weather on the new version because it, this is. Um, if you haven't, if you don't know, mods have to be updated. So, best your best go now and check in when it was last updated, and looking at the version logs and check if he has it updated. So this is updated for 1.5 base, so I'm going to go ahead and download it. Oh, to the top there. Um, download. Once you've got it downloaded, you're going to go into your plugins folder. You're going to go into your downloads folder. You're going to drag that to the uh, desktop or whatever. You can drag it directly to the thing. It doesn't really matter. The folder. Sorry for this fucking all pans just much easier. So you drag <coughs> the plugin to your plugin folder 
and then you're gonna run your server oh, by the way if you're gonna put plugins make you best off just closing the server beforehand and when you run it if you look it will ooh, hey errors don't we all if you look you could um yeah it says could not load I don't know why it couldn't load it yeah. but anyway that's basically it you just have to plug in plug in into your plugin folder and then it should work for some reason that isn't working I don't know but it works on my actual server folder um, so that's pretty much all you need to know to be quite honest the IP that people are going to be connecting to is your IP so you might as well just go to what is my IP address as I like google it and yeah if you don't already know it that is um, so that think that is all you need to know to be honest um, yeah I think that is so that's how you make a bucket 1.5 um, um, beta server and thanks for watching um, sorry if I mean not sorry but if I get comments saying are you speaking English you're clearly a 12 year old fail troll because every country has different accents if you haven't known already you're super pricks just saying alright and that's pretty much it guys and thanks for watching if you need any help leave in the comments and I'll try my best to reply as I'm not on this account as much as I used to be alright um, peace